This summer, we'll be doing a deep dive into the science, technology, history, and culture behind one of humanity's most incredible stories, Pompeii. All the way back in the year 79 CE, the growing and relatively new city of Pompeii had an intense experience with the stratovolcano next door, Mount Vesuvius. This eruption would go on to destroy and bury the city of Pompeii, leaving it frozen in time, until about 200 years ago when it was rediscovered and excavated. Since then, archaeologists and scientists have been piecing together the lives and times of this ancient place. After studying the ruins, we now know that despite being an ancient civilization, these folks were actually pretty advanced. These innovative thinkers had a remarkably advanced lifestyle considering the time, and even paved the way for some things in our world today. For example, we're all used to forced air climate control at our homes, right? Well, they had a version of it too. A series of passageways connected by a central furnace room helped them send heat into specific homes. We have streets designed for traffic flow, and so did they. By studying the wear and tear from cartwheels rubbing against cornerstones, scientists were able to piece together Pompeii's traffic patterns in their streets. Oh, and those streets also had elevated walking stones to keep your sandals and toga from touching the wet or dirty street below. Meanwhile, we still get soggy socks every time it rains here. We've got sewage systems, they did too. Monuments, yeah, they had those. Vineyards and bars, yep, they had those too. An amphitheater? Yeah, they had one. Actually, it's the oldest known amphitheater in the world. All of this in addition to specialized plumbing, the odometer, and all the wine-related contraptions one could handle. Drop by the Science Museum of Virginia and take a look at this ancient world through the lens of science to see how we're really not all that different. We've just had a little more time to make fidget spinners and snuggies and such. Pompeii, the immortal city, has over a hundred artifacts and will be open all summer long. Come check it out.